Hey there, I've got a great punk rock score to tell you about. And especially if you're a fan of my favorite punk band, the Dickies. Check this out. So I know a guy named Sharon from the UK. He's a long time hardcore Dickies fan. Uh, I remember back 15, 20 years ago when I first uh, became acquainted with him, he was running the Dickies official website. And he was always providing fans with cool bootleg recordings. I was always trading CDs and cassettes with him and um, uh, it was great. So years down the road, you know, life gets in the way sometimes. He was not able to really run the Dickies website uh, adequately anymore. And so I took over maybe three years ago, two years ago, and um, started running the site. Well, long story short, recently Sharon posted on Facebook on a Dickies fan page that he had discovered in his attic or some storage space a uh, hundred, that's one zero zero, one hundred bootleg Dickies cassette tapes, demos, live stuff, etc. He put them up as kind of like, hey, anybody want these? Cover shipping and they're yours. And I was thinking, okay, I'm in the US, he's in the UK, that's not going to be cheap, but I'm going to do it because I want to make sure that if there's anything on there that could be made into an official bootleg or some kind of cool release for the Dickies, that we can uh, make that happen. And I have connections here uh, in town. My friend Ian Shannon is one person in particular that can help me transfer these tapes to digital format so that we could uh, save them. So here we go. Look, this is what I got. Oh, that's 100 tapes from the UK. And they're all Dickies tapes. So let's get into it and look at them and see what's in here. All right, everyone, here we go. Two boxes, large boxes of Dickies tapes from the UK. Hopefully worthy of being digitized and uh, maybe released as some kind of official bootleg for the band. Now, let's cut this open. Let's see here. This one needs a little more cutting. There we go. There's one. Okay. And here's number two. Oh, God mighty. There we go. All right, everybody. First box. We'll just get an idea of what's in here. Okay. We have Dickie's Demos. Los Angeles, 1978. Oh, more demos. Lots of demos there. Dickies Archives, Volume 1. December demos. More demos. 1985, looks like. Music Machine, April 1984. City Gardens, 82. Wow. As you can see, I'm going to be busy. And I think what I'm going to start on, Ritz, New York, 91, 1990. I'm going to start on the uh, demos. And any demos that have not been released as bootlegs yet, those are going to be the ones I focus on. Hollywood, 98. Troubadour, 99, it looks like. Wow. Maxwell's. New Jersey, 1991. Very cool. Look at this here. London, 98. November, 96. Two shows, 1997. I may have been at some of these shows in the 90s. And if I found the show, the first Dickie show that I ever went to, Charlotte, North Carolina, 1988, I'd freak out. But I don't think that's going to happen. Oh, here's an empty one. Okay. The Dickies, New York City, 81. Pretty cool. Looks like there's another show on there too. 92 maybe. Maybe this is 91. My eyes aren't what they used to be, y'all. 92 and 91. There we go. 92 and 91. All right. The Dickies, Live Canada, 83 plus 1978 demos. Very cool. Just keeps going. 
Banana Splits, 20th Anniversary Show, 1997. Dickies, Coconut Teaser, Hollywood, 1990. 1991, looks like. Man, lots of stuff. Uh, SLF, Suspect Device, Wasted Life. I don't know what this is. We'll have to dig into that later. Long Beach 89, uh, unmarked tape, unmarked tape, it's going to be interesting going through those unmarked tapes, oh, here's one, Dickies 87, opening for Red Hot Chili Peppers, okay, let's see what tape that might be, I'm going to take a guess and say it's this Maxell right there, all right, uh, let's see, 1987, San Diego, 82 and 81 live. Uh, another unmarked one. Let's see what this says here. Ah, Dickies Los Angeles 89 at Music Machine. You know, if I could take some of these live ones and pick up, pick out just the best tracks, now that might be there, but Lawndale, California 96. I'm hoping this one is. And I'm, you know, I'm hoping that maybe we take uh, live tracks. From these things, some of the best ones, and make a comp of those. 1999, London. Uh, but yeah, there's lots of possibilities here, depending on the uh, quality of these tapes. And there's one that's not marked, but I will figure it out. Oh, here we go. I bet you this is it. Fuji. Long Beach 89, Long Beach 88. Okay, good deal. Okay, so, as you can see, just a bunch of live stuff, right? Getting a good idea of what's in here. Um, Dickies Whiskey A Go Go, 82, 82. Uh, Dickies Bootlegs says there. Um, let's go over to the next box and see how much more is there. There we go. How much Dickies can you handle? Look at this. Dickies, 1997. Uh, Dickies, 1990, 91. 97, 91, 91. What are these here? These look cool. Coconut Teaser Hollywood, 1990. Uh, 1990 and 91 looks like here. Crazy. Roxy, Hollywood. All, Halloween 98. Cool. Dickie's Coconut Teaser 90. I wonder if some of these are just different uh, recordings of the same show, different quality. LA Music Machine 84, UCLA 84. Very cool. Yep, this is what I did. I spent... Uh, 200 bucks, a little more on this, uh, but I think it's going to be worth it, especially if I could save some of these recordings from, you know, deteriorating on these tapes. Oh, 1985 demos, rehearsal 1985, great, great stuff. Uh, let's see, Birmingham, 1991, a show from 80, 82, and 86 there, 1996. Oh, man, lots of stuff, 80s, more 80s shows. Goes on and on. Oh, look at this. The Dickies, 1982, 1998. I swear, I'm going to find a show in here that I was at. It's got to happen. Whoopsie. Here's uh, Viper Room, Los Angeles. In 90, looks like 1990. 96. Might have been there. I don't know. Olympic Auditorium, Music Machine, Dates Unknown. Lawndale, 96. Uh, another one that's un unmarked. Let's see. Viper Room, 96. Spain, 95. That's cool. Uh, what's this? Let's see. 
Moguls, Hollywood, February 97, Glass House, Pomona, 97. Cool. I know I saw some shows out there in California in the 90s. Uh, Dickie's Roxy and the Whiskey, 1980. Let's see here. Almost done. Just giving you a brief view of what uh, we got here. Dickie's Live, Washington, D.C., Dickie's Interviews. Another remote tape. Huntington Beach, 86. San Francisco, 96. 91 and 1980. Dickies Bogarts, 88. That's the tour I saw them on the very first time, the 1988 tour. Uh, Northridge, California. Long Beach, 2000. One more row here to go. Music Machine, Olympic Auditorium, Los Angeles. Let's see, is this Killer Clowns Tour? No, 1979 and 1984 shows, it looks like. Uh, another one that is maybe unmarked. Yep. Berkeley, 1980. Dickies, Washington, 82. Let's see. Washington, 82. Moguls, 97. Glasshouse, 97. Yeah, there's there's got to be multiples of some of these. The Garage, England, 98. Uh, let's see here. Dragonfly, 98. Laguna Club, 89. Boston Rat, 91. September, 95. Spain. Thirty Club, 1983, both sets. All right, and here's the last little batch here. Okay, Coconut Tees here again. Hollywood, 97, Billboard Live. Long Beach, 89, Pomona, 84. Hollywood Palladium, 86, The Ritz, 88. Uh, Long Beach, 97. Coconut Teaser 90, UCLA, a music machine, and Rosita, California 89. So, you guys, we got a whole bunch of Dickies. A whole bunch of Dickies here. And uh, we're going to try to make use of this stuff and make the fans proud and make the band proud. You know what? We're going to really do our damnedest to digitize the best, most interesting stuff uh, of these tapes. Uh, the stuff that has not been released in any form yet. And uh, wish us luck. We have a lot of work ahead of us. Thank you, Sharon, uh, for this opportunity. Thank you, Ian Shannon, for agreeing to help me with this digitizing process. And uh, thank you all for the likes on my videos, for the subscriptions to my channel. May the rock and roll gods bless you as they blessed me. And I'll see you later.